peace, love, light, and darkness to all my reflections. I hope y'all having a beautiful night, I mean, or a beautiful day. Y'all know I'm in Michigan, right? So right now, what is it? It's about like 7 p.m. in Michigan. You know, I'm on Easter Standard Time. So wherever y'all at, good day or good night. But no, y'all, I just came over here to talk about something very simple and very quick. And that's preparedness. You know, like, it's a lot of things that's about to be happening. And it's a lot of changes that's going to be taking place. There's no need for anyone to panic. The best thing to do is just to prepare yourself. And when I say prepare, I'm talking about mentally. So if you've been feeling like you had the voice in the back of your mind telling you, like, I'm about to cut down on eating this, do it. Just do it. If you've been ignoring that voice in the back of your head that's been telling you you need to get something done, you need to stay away from certain people, do it. Listen to yourself as much as possible right now, okay? Because your discernment is going to be very much needed. There, we are going to be, well, we've already been manipulated with so much information, so much lies, you know? We've really been infiltrated with nothing but misinformation because they know that we are in the time of the awakening. They know that we are in the time of the Aquarius where everyone is tapping into themselves and getting their powers, you know what I mean? And I mean getting their powers on a genetic level. These upgrades that we're getting from the mass corona blast from the suns, that shit is nothing but a DNA repair, you know? So we say DNA upgrade, but it's really not nothing that's upgrading us with the sun. What's happening is that the sun is repairing the damages that we have in our body on a genetic level because we have been fucked with on a genetic level. This is the reason why we can't do the things we used to be able to do. This is the reason why we can't, you know, all of our natural abilities, what you would call supernatural powers, the reason why we're not able to easily perform it or even the reason why we're not able to instantly manifest the things we want because we're supposed to be able to manifest what we want instantly but it's all because of that we have been fucked with on a genetic level it's been a lot of spiritual warfare is going on so with that being said this sun is actually reversing that everything that was damaged or anything that was genetically modified you know what the sun is going to do is the sun is going to come and repair and restore now they know this they've been doing this for a very long time so i am saying for us to just be aware and be careful because it's going to be every attack on you spiritually and physically and mentally this year and for years to come i mean it's it's already been happening but it's going to get stronger it's going to get stronger because we've been having the little solar flares but we haven't had that solar flash you feel what i'm saying so these solar flares that's been coming off. This this been this solar flares have been happening for years. Like we just knowing about it now, but they're getting stronger and they're hitting the atmosphere with a lot of intensity, which is the reason why you've seen that they have up their production when it comes to the damn chemtrails and shit. Like they've made sure that they have put ten times much as chemtrails out there to do more than one thing. You know, or obviously they want to block out the sun. That's obvious. But another thing they want to do is they want to stop that photon energy from getting here. And they know they can't stop it, but they're going to try to slow it down. So with that being said, you're going to see a lot of attacks being done on you. Now, these attacks is being done spiritually, but they're attacking you to affect you in your livelihood. So the attacks going to seem like they're very, very physical. Okay? So right now, y'all, they're doing everything possible to get rid of any and everything that has been assisted by the government. So anybody that's been getting food stamps, anybody that's been getting um, what they call Section 8 or rent vouchers, anybody that's been getting money to help with assistance with their children, anything that you have been getting assistance from, from the government, they're completely shutting all those programs down, okay? Those programs are being completely shut down. And they are doing that for a very systematic reason because they made sure the majority of the low-income people who was dependent on their system, they made, they made sure that they stayed dependent on their system for a very long time. Just so that they can take away everything they've ever given you. This is fact. Okay, so we have to, it's, it's just time to be aware that these things are going to happen. It's already, it's already in motion, okay? Another thing you're going to see is a more attack on what you put inside your body, okay? I told you, y'all, this is very spiritual, but it's going, you're going to see it in a physical sense. 
anything they anything they're gonna have to try to do to attack you on a physical level is gonna be done this year and years to come. Okay? So any kind of fools, any kind of new fools that come out, you shouldn't even want them. You know, any type of new meats, and even if it's some new plant based ass meat, don't fall for that plant based shit either, because that's not right. You know, like this um what's that meat substitute that Mr. Gates wanna give everybody that beyond meat and all shit like that? If you even just read the back of it, you will see that that shit does way more harm than good. Like, by ten times more. Okay? So, what I'm saying right now, y'all, y'all, look, what I'm saying is that just be prepared to see all this shit happening, okay? And don't get overwhelmed. Don't be deferred because it's going to be a lot of shit happening to us. It's going to make you feel so frustrated. It's gonna You're going to have a lot of financial complications going on, especially if you don't agree with the new system they're about to implement. Because I don't know if a lot of you understand or know this yet, but there is about to be a whole nother monetary system put in place to replace the cash system we are currently using. And now, if you want to look this up, the system that they are switching up to is called the ISO 20022. Okay? Look that up. ISO 20022. That is the whole system we're switching over to. It's a messenger system. But within that messenger system, you send encryptions back and forth, which is like money. Okay? They're changing that. So everything you're seeing this year and the years to come, you're going to see a lot of things fall. You're going to see a lot of things change. And you're going to see a lot more restrictions when it comes on what you can do and what you cannot do. Because what they're really trying to do is they're trying to create their new prison matrix. They, they see how this matrix is kind of like falling apart and this matrix, people are waking up to the bullshit within that matrix. So what they're doing is they're creating a more solidified matrix. They're, they're creating a matrix that you're going to be stuck in for the rest of time. Like this is going to be the last matrix that they create because this matrix is going to be so strong that it's going to really be a fucking entrapment. And they're going to entrap you on a genetic level to the matrix. At first they had you trapped to the matrix by paper. By straw man. Now they're going to connect you to the matrix and make it permanent on a genetic level by literally genetically modifying you and connecting you with the matrix. That's fucking game over, y'all. Okay? That is game over. That is game over. That's why my heart just goes out to those who were manipulated into getting vaccinated. vaccinated. Because that all that was, that was pure pure 100% manipulation. That's all that was. Manipulating people and shit. Because all that's all they did was manipulate everybody. They gave out. I've never seen them come out with so many ways to bribe people in my life. You mean to tell them this is supposed to be for their health? Really? I've never seen you give nobody lottery tickets, uh, free money, food, Shoes, clothes, all kind of shit you throw in there just for them to take a shot. Coming from someone who's always enabled and enslaved you. Coming from someone who specifically have you in the predicament you are right now. We all are. Why would we even trust what they say? But that's all. That's done. That's done. Only thing we can do right now is be better and move on. And we do that by being prepared. And you prepare yourself by knowing what's going to happen. You know what their tactics are. When you know how the enemy moves, then you know you can prepare yourself for what's to come. And that's what I'm saying, y'all. So look into that. I told you about that. They're changing the whole money system. They, there's no more assistance with the, the, the food. There's no more assistance with houses, okay? There's no more assistance with your kids, okay? This is the reason why they did this. Because they, they specifically and systematically broke up our households. So guess what? It's all these women out here on Section 8, all who was on Section 8 and getting food stamps. Now you have to take away the food stamps and the Section 8 after y'all have made them kick the whole man out the house? You don't think that was a systematic plan? Mm, mm, mm. It's time, y'all. It's time. It's time for us to come together. Fuck all of our differences, okay? I don't get, The differences that we have with each other is nothing compared to the differences that we have with our oppressors. Okay? This shit has to stop. And it stops with us. 
It stops with us stopping shit. It stops with us not condoning things just because a higher authority is allowing it. Okay? I just want y'all to be safe and just, you know, just stay hip to what's going on. All right? Peace, love, light, and darkness. I love y'all. I'm going to come back and make sure I drop a video every day. Like, I'm really going to hold myself to that. I'm going to drop a video every day. Even if it's a five-minute video, I'm going to drop something every day so I can get, you know, my content going on the page. But I love y'all and y'all stay up.